All right, coming up next, a UFC featherweight division fight. Well, DC, this is a true mixed martial artist of the highest order. You've watched the film. Hard for me to see much in terms of glaring weaknesses, and he believes he can react to anything that is thrown his way inside that arm. It's unbelievable because whenever you're trying to prepare for someone, you look for weaknesses. But when you watch this guy, you, nothing jumps off the page. When you think I have to go wrestle him, you realize very quickly that not only can he defend takedowns, he can also go and secure the sure. himself. He's that new breed of fighter that has been doing every discipline from the very start of his career. You know you're looking at a guy that will contend for a championship. And if our fighter meeting on Thursday is any indication, confidence, not an issue for this young man coming in here tonight. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem Abdul-Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once. I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Our tale of the tape for this featherweight fight. Three years apart, and they both possess a similar height and reach. Now to get us started, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buck. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 11 wins, two losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Super Sonic Usa! And now for his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California. Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. They're the best of the best that we can put inside the octagon. They are so well-rounded. They have every skill, and that is going to be on display tonight in this key matchup. All right, single collar tie now. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. That's a big strike right there. Manti, oh, beautifully executed trip to get the takedown defensively. What are you trying to do to prevent that? You gotta be so aware defensively. Because if you're not, the moment you're out of position, a guy like this will find those takedowns with those trips in all kinds of different scenarios. Lee gets 
gets touched by that kick right to the body there. Nicely done by the opponent. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. All right, he'll engage in a single column tie. Oh, judges had to like that uppercut. Oh, man, he lands another punch to the head. Shows him the left and then follows it up with a right. Nice one-two punch there by Lee. Well, he continues to stay busy and he continues to land with volume punches here. I mean, volume, but he's not wasting them. He needs to get the ice on John. He needs to get in the space so that he doesn't get finished. Oh, he might be out. Lands a big elbow there. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. He got the turtle in that kick. Series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Big call for punch land. Now we get back to range. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh! He's out of he got him! What a fight! Just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near-perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, he saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout. All right, let's re-rack the highlight now, DC, and he's certainly going to enjoy watching this one back. The head kick was there early, it was there often, and ultimately ended the night for his opponent. He found a weakness in his opponent's game. The left kick, over and over, he was able to land it. And he was landing the strikes, too, with his hands, but ultimately, it was the kick that was hidden behind the punch that finished the fight for him. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest. At four minutes, nine seconds of the very first round. Playing the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon.